up, peeps? Today I'm going to explore New York City to see the festive Christmas stuff because that's something that I've been really looking forward to was the Christmas season and a lot of the stuff is just outside, you can see it all. But first, let me show you the ball drop. This is where it's happening. I feel like everybody should know this, but if you don't in New York City, the ball drops and it's on New Year's Eve, they do the countdown and then that falls and then it's a celebration of the new year. I'm not gonna watch that, hell no. I'm not standing outside for a ball drop. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna show you guys all the Christmassy stuff. I hope you enjoy. Across the street is Bryant Park Christmas themed shops. So we're gonna go check that out first. and you want to skate, go to Rockefeller Center. But I would still do this just to be different. I remember I used to love coming to fountains to take all the quarters out of them. Look at all that money in there, that's a lot. You're looking at the semi-precious stone, it's called Luminite. There's so many shops with food all along here, and I decided to get into the canned pie. Do you guys remember last year during the lockdown when I got hives like all over my body and I looked ridiculous? Well, one of the things that I did, I still don't know why I got the hives, but I had made a pecan pie, and I did give some of it away, but most of it, I literally ate that entire pie by myself. So. Hopefully I don't get hives from this. Yeah, I'm walking along Fifth Avenue because there's so many Christmas decorations along the way. Here's one of them. beautiful store in New York and their decorations are really nice. I took a detour from Saks because I've been looking for a winter coat and this one's pretty cute. What do you guys think? But I don't think I'm gonna get this one because I'm still looking. Like I want something a little different but I did want a green jacket for a while. Huh. Oh it's so fluffy and warm. It is warm. That's what I need. I need something warm for New York definitely it's been freezing and it's not even the height of winter. This is exciting because I wasn't on this side when I went roller skating. I'm above now, so I can show you this point of view and everybody was able to see me falling. Here is NBC Studios. I don't know if you guys remember, but I did an interview there years ago, which was pretty cool. I like how the streets are blocked off. There's like way more space, finally. I'm walking down the 6th Street right now because I heard there's a really pretty Christmas tree that I want to see. I'm just doing all the festive things. Chestnuts roasting. Not quite on an open fire, on an open cart in New York City. Candy canes over here. I love everything. It's so exciting. Oh my god, I just turned. I didn't even notice that was right behind me. I turned around and boom. Wow, New York is like the best for Christmas time. Oh my god, I love it. In front of me are the beautiful big red Christmas balls. I love these. And there's a fountain in the bushes. There's more money in there. Look at all that money. I found the Christmas tree. This is one of them. And 
this is one of the most beautiful cathedrals. I like this a lot because it's like so traditional, not traditional, so you tell me the word I'm looking for, but it's so New York. So iconic, I guess you could say. Iconic. I love it. Oh, look, there's presents in the trunk. This is pretty cool. The whole Cartier store is covered like a present. That's the whole store wrapped like a present. It's cold outside, but the fire this is keeps so cool. us warm. Wow. We can spend the night. Underneath the mistletoe. I'm so glad I did this. It's so fun. This is the Peninsula Hotel. They have a beautiful display, and I've heard it's a really nice hotel. I've never been in here until right now. Very pretty decorations. Wow, this is huge, guys. Look, it's way bigger than my hand. Oh my god. And I've gotten you a present that I put under the tree. Tomorrow it is Christmas. Oh my god, that's so cool. You can't come in and take candy? Guys, what? This is no way. Should I get some candy? As long as you're around, everything will be okay. They have a rooftop here, and it's really pretty. I'm at least gonna just check it out. This is super cute. We're definitely gonna come back here one day. There's like private little rooms in here. to get a bag of candy, guys. <laughs> but there were adults in there too, so I got myself a bag of candy. All right, guys, I have to film the front of this hotel. It's super cute. I've never stayed there, but I give it five stars because I got the candy. <laughs> I'm out of place in a sea full of smiles Walking down Main Street tonight Got a lot on my mind since you walked out and said Merry Christmas, Look at this bougie babe. display window And there's no way around Better join in the holiday crowd This is the Louis Vuitton display on the corner of their building While I'm struggling to find some peace of mind So I want to show you guys this It's like the only Jewish thing I've seen in all of New York so far It's like so Christmas themed which I love but I also feel like they need to share with the other holidays and stuff. But where's a dreidel? The doggy and the dreidel. If you guys know what these letters are in Hebrew, let us know in the comments. Because I don't know. This store is called Bergdorf Goodman's. They have tons of pretty displays as well. Yeah, the streets might be full, but I'm empty inside. Merry Christmas, babe. Wish you a Which makes it all seem great. Oh, I love this. This is so cute. So, when I was a little girl, I was like, well, my parents bought me a little seal that looked like this. And I lost it, and I was so sad. I thought it was the cutest thing ever. It literally looked like that. Here's the mailbox to send letters to Santa. Santa's I can literally die. I was like in the middle of filming the rest of the Christmas stuff for you guys. But anyway, I came to this Capitol Square place, Easy Kaya, Easy Kaya. I was able to charge my camera. That's my food right there. And I have some skewers cooking right here. Motion. That's where I was, Easy Kaya place. The skewers, I think, were good. I feel bad, but they were so nice. They were so sweet, but I didn't like the dish. The yakitori stuff was good, though. Ooh, look at these pretty cars. I swear, one day, I want a bow on a car. Look how pretty it is. I'm trying to find one more thing before I go back home. There's a Christmassy festive restaurant slash bar thing. I'm going to try to make it there before they close. Found it. Oh my god, this place is gorgeous. 
They're getting ready to close. You know me, I'm gonna show you as much as I can. For all eternity. I love this thing. I didn't even want to drink anyway, I kind of just wanted to see it. I'm glad they're closing and nobody's here and I get to see it to myself. This is called Papillon, I think. Let me stand at your door. So that's the restaurant part. This is the bar. Place five out of five for Christmas decorations. They go all out. <laughs> I don't know if you guys could see. Look right there. That guy. <laughs> he was in the bar. He wanted my number. And then he comes outside. He's smoking a cigarette. I'm like, Ugh, nope. Never mind. <laughs> That's such a turn off. Cigarettes. Such a turn off. Also, <laughs> I'm thinking about it. Like, how how cute do I possibly look with this? giant bag of candy bulging out of my pocket like what the it's just bulging out like this big thing <laughs> well that's how i am take me or leave me i stumbled across this by accident but it's really nice these horses are probably one of my favorite christmas decorations oh my god it's so cute look at this it feels kind of sketchy down here because there's like nobody down here i'm getting on the subway right now see you guys in the next video i love you if i don't see you until christmas merry christmas happy new year peace on the street zone